Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a GIF out of any YouTube video. I have made a tutorial about this in the past, but it's been a year or so and some things have changed. So I'm going to show you an updated version here today. Similar to last time, you just want to go to the video that you want to make a GIF out of. At the top in the URL, just before YouTube, you want to type in GIF or GIF, however you pronounce it. And it'll come up with this. This is very different to my last tutorial. A couple of things have changed. So the first thing you're going to want to do is pick which part of the video you want to turn into a GIF. Um, I'm thinking I might do... So you just click and drag to what time. And I think it's pretty self-explanatory. You just click and drag to what part you want to make a GIF. So I'm going to do the doll getting her hair brushed. I think that's kind of creepy. But whatever. So I'll just have that. So when you're happy with the times you've selected, just click the little tick. Now there's heaps of new features that they've added. You can add a caption, which is really cool. Um, you can change the font. Um, you can just click on it and type in whatever you like, and then you can drag it to anywhere in the GIF. That's pretty cool. You can also add stickers. Um, heaps of different stickers to choose from. You just click on the one that you like and you just place it in there. It's pretty cool if you're into that. You can also crop your GIF if you want to. Um, I don't really think this is necessary if you're just doing a YouTube video, but whatever you want to do. You can add padding, but um, no, I don't think we need padding. Um, we have some effects. Now these are really cool. I really love the GTA one. I'm a huge fan of GTA, so I think this is awesome that they've added that feature. You can also add a Thug Life. Um, that's pretty cool. And Brazers. Also pretty cool. Um, and then you can change the blur. So you can click and drag and make it as blurry as you want it to. You can change the hue, the invert, the saturation. Which is all pretty cool. You can flip it so that it's vertical or horizontal and add a freeze frame. But I'm happy with this. So after you're done, you just click create GIF. You say no thanks. And then you end up on this page. Now, it is kind of frustrating that they have added a watermark onto the bottom of your GIFs. But that's a small price to pay because they have increased the quality of the GIFs immensely. So, same thing as last time. If you want to get the link for it, you just click the direct link, click copy, open a new tab and paste it in there. See the little watermarks here, but what can you do? This is a really simple, like, you just do it all on your browser, so it's kind of what you expect for something like this. If you want to save it onto your computer, you just right click, save image as, and then just save it wherever you like. And then it's there on your computer. Um, yeah, you can upload this straight to Tumblr, to Facebook, like wherever you want to put your GIF. If you just want to keep it on your computer, that's fine. And yeah. So that's the tutorial I've got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!